guys, so today I am back and a lot of you requested a more like everyday simple natural makeup look that you can just slap on before you go to school, work, college, whatever it is that you do and this is the look that I came up with so if you want to see how I got this look just keep watching. So to start off I use my strobing cream from Primark as my primer, it's just the PS range primer, I'm not exactly sure what the exact name of it is but it will, everything will be down in the description bar. And would I even be a YouTuber if I didn't have the Mario Badescu spray? So yeah, had to spray that for some extra hydration. Then I just added my Maybelline BB Cream and again I'm not sure the exact one that I used but it will be in the description bar. This is very sheer coverage and I was going for something very lightweight so because it's an everyday type of look. So if you wanted something full coverage I definitely wouldn't go for the BB Cream, I'd go for something like a foundation, like the Bourjois Healthy Mix, something like that instead. To conceal those dark circles, I use the Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer in Fair. Using my Real Techniques blending sponge, I just blended all that concealer in wherever I put it. Set all that concealer and BB cream. I just use the Rimmel Stay Matte Translucent Powder, and yeah, I just put that everywhere I did my concealer because you definitely don't want to be a greasy mess for the whole day. For my contour slash bronzer, I took my Collection Duo, which is the I think Highlight and Sculpt Duo. And I just took the contour shade in that and put that in all the places that I wanted to bronze up my skin. And if you're very pale like me, this contour shade is actually really good for a really cheap price because it isn't too orange that like for a very pale skin tone it will make you just look like a tangerine dream. So you're all good. For blush I just used my Milani Luminoso blush and yeah put that on the apples of my cheeks. For my highlight I just went back into that duo and I took the highlight shade in that and I wanted something very subtle so for this look it was actually perfect because it doesn't come off too much of a sheen but it's just a nice glow. For the eyes I just wanted something very subtle but a bit of definition on the eyes so I went into the mineral eyeshadow palette that I have from Penny's or Primark and I just took the very pink, very pale pink shade and I also took the brown shade. I just put the pink all over my eyelid as you can see before that and with the brown shade right now, I am just putting it into my crease just for a bit of definition. To finish off the eyes, I just used my Rimmel Chubby Pencil in the shade brown and put that in my waterline and then added a bit of mascara. And the mascara I used was the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara.
moving on to my eyebrows, I went in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills brow definer in dark brown and I just fixed those caterpillars because they're the biggest mess in the world. I really have to get them done. To set my eyebrows I just use my Anastasia Beverly Hills clear brow gel. To finish off this look I just went in with a lip crayon from Penny's and it was only like $2.50, they are so handy and the shade I'm using is Nude Beach. So this is the finished result. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, please give it a like, subscribe if you want to, comment down below if you have any suggestions for any other videos in the coming future, or if you just want to say hi, that's cool too. And I'll see you in my next video.